proteins are <coughs> perform different functions in this some in some are act as the enzymes and some are proteins and some are <coughs> hormones and some proteins are transport of nutrient material nutrient material across the membrane across the membrane it means some proteins are used as that enzyme some are hormones some are some proteins are transport nutrient material across the membrane some proteins are act as some proteins are acts as <coughs> fight to infectious organisms fight to infectious organisms okay <coughs> i am also explained that collagen is that uh, abundant protein in animal world collagen is abundant protein in animal world in animal world after that trubisco it is a ribulose rubp it is known as ribulose bisphosphate carboxylase and oxygenase it is abundant protein it is abundant protein in whole biosphere in whole biosphere what is that abundant protein rubisco rubp carboxylase and <coughs> oxygenase so that is known as that okay so abundant protein in that uh, whole biosphere okay after that some proteins and their functions protein and function first one that collagen it is intercellular ground intercellular ground tissue it is known as that intercellular ground tissue abundant protein in the animal world after that glut four so it in it able to transport of 
ग्लूकोज टेबल टू ट्रांसपोर्ट ऑफ ग्लूकोज टू सेल इट एबल टू ट्रांसपोर्ट ऑफ ग्लूकोज टू सेल ग्लट फोर आफ्टर दट इंसुलिन सो दिस इंसुलिन इज एक्ट एज एट हार्मोन आफ्टर दट ट्रिप्सिन so trypsin it is that enzyme after that antibiotic it fights it fights infectious organisms it fights infectious organism antibiotic after that <coughs> receptor so it is that sensory sensor receptors sensor receptors that is known as that smell taste and hormone okay so protein and their function generally first one is a glucose it is the intracellular ground substance or ground tissue ground substance or tissue okay so after that after that glut four it is able to transport of glucose to cell insulin hormone trypsin is the enzyme antibiotic it fights infectious organisms receptors sensor receptors smell taste and hormone so these are that important point about the protein and their functions so it is important for objective fight medical beds okay so that is known as that protein and their function after the proteins <coughs> after that protein polysaccharides polysaccharides also mm. acid insoluble pellet polysaccharides are acid insoluble pellets acid insoluble pellets okay so generally they are that long chains of sugars long chains of sugars so in this monosaccharides act as building blocks so most of that generally some polysaccharides are homopolysaccharide some are heteropolysaccharide some polysaccharides are
ஹோமோபாலிமர்ஸ் ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் செல்யூலோஸ் இட் இஸ் அட் ஹோமோ பாலி சாக்ரைட் ஆஃப் பாலிமர் ஹோமோ பாலி சாக்ரைட் ஆஃப் பாலிமர் so this one type of uh, saccharides are present in this one type of in this similar type in this similar type of monosaccharides are present so in this similar types of uh, monosaccharides are present so that is known as that glucose okay it means uh, glucose molecules are connected to form a chain so that is that uh, polymer of polysaccharide that cellulose and there one is starch it is also homo polymer of polysaccharide it is also homo polymer of polysaccharide so in this this starch is stored food material it is it is storage food material it is storage food material in plants it is storage food material in plants okay so that is known as that uh, starch <coughs> after that glycogen is another polysaccharide glycogen is another polysaccharide it stores it is act as storage material <coughs> storage material in animal in animal in animal storage material is that glycogen okay so it is a important point after that inulin inulin it is another homo polymer of polysaccharide homo polymer of polysaccharide made up of similar type of monosaccharide similar type of monosaccharide so that is known as that fructose okay so inulin it is another homo polymer of polysaccharide made up of similar type of monosaccharides so this similar type of monosaccharides are known as that fructose okay so after that you observe in the glycogen so glycogen is having that okay right hand and left hand in glycogen right hand having reducing and reducing and 
and left hand is non reducing end reducing end non reducing end in that glycogen it is appear just like cartoon picture it is appear like cartoon picture it is a previous medical bit cartoon picture having branches having branches having branches it is important point for example it is known as the glycogen it having appear that just like that cartoon picture type so it having that branches okay one is a reducing end another one is that non reducing it is appear just a cartoon picture okay so that is known as that